<laughs> All right. Take two. <laughs> Take two. Okay, we're gonna, here we're going to name the muscles of the cat. This is the pecto antibrachialis, a muscle that the, uh, humans do not have. This is the pectoralis major, which extends all the way under the pecto antibrachialis. This is the pectoralis minor, and this is the xiphi humoralis. Notice that the pectoralis minor very often is larger than the pectoralis major in the cat, because remember, these muscles are named from the human. Now we're going to go down to the abdominal area. More. Okay. And we're going to name the muscles here. This is the external oblique. Notice the direction of the fibers. You can see the fibers there. They're actually going in this direction as if you're putting your hands in your pocket. <coughs> we dissected that earlier. And then underneath we have the internal oblique right here. You can see how the fibers are going in a totally different direction. And then the transverse abdominus, which takes us over to the linea alba. There is a rectus abdominis, which doesn't seem to show up very well in this cat, which would be right here. So we've got one muscle that we guess we're just not going to be able to show very well. Okay, let's stop for a second. <laughs>